So one of our biggest problems has been finding the goats and we have finally got them located here and we managed to find a tracking collar that I think is going to work decent. We'll see. Uh, but we put it on blue. I uh, don't know if I can, you can see it or not. Right there on his neck. That should help us locate blue, which he's, you know, 99 times out of 100, he's with the goats. So uh, we will locate him and hopefully go straight to the goats. We can do all that from our cell phone with an app. It's a real cool little deal. I'm just waiting to see how it performs kind of before I uh, uh, say a bunch of stuff. Uh, but anyway, uh, Bill Costanzo at, at Texas A&M AgriLife in uh, San Angelo is who introduced it to us. And I don't think he's even had a chance to try it yet because he was trying to, they were trying to catch a dog. And so we, we just now got it put on blue, and so we'll see how it works. I was going to put it on red because he's always with the goats, too. And uh, he, uh, he thought he was caught when I put that collar on him. He just laid there. He wouldn't get up and move, wouldn't go anywhere. So I could tell right away that wasn't going to work with him. So see, he doesn't even like me videoing him. And, oh, okay. I guess he's more relaxed than I thought. But anyway, old Red didn't like that collar on him. And so I took it off of him and now he's fine. And we already had a same, same kind of collar on blue. And so he was okay with it. By the way, this is red. And this right over here, white. And then this dog is called blue. And people may want to know why he's called blue. Blue, blue. Yeah, I don't know if you can see it or not, but half of the white in his eyes on both sides is blue uh, so we got red white and blue so we thought that was good anyway the goats are here yeah that's a good boy let me see your let me see your eyes let me see your eyes oh there they are yeah okay good boy good boy 